Mike from D-Sport Magazine here. We're in the Club D-Sport machine shop. Today I wanted to go over a relatively new piston coating uh, coming to the market right now called Electroless Nickel. This is a plating process uh, that's done to the, generally the, to the crown and the top ringland area of the piston. And what it establishes basically is a very, very, very hard corrosion resistant surface that'll give you some advantages over a non-coated piston. The two pistons I have here are non-coated. These are out of the Mackin 2JZ GTE Pikes Peak FRS. One of these here, you can see a nice crack in it. You can see evidence that this piston got extremely hot. Uh, so hot, in fact, that it was scoring the bore. You've got rings stuck in here. You've got all kinds of, of madness happening. Essentially, that was the result of a bad injector, a bad injector causing a lean situation, a lean situation causing tremendous amount of heat and resulting in this type of problem here. Now, no coating in the world is gonna protect against uh, a failure of, of, this, of this type, but uh, some of the better coatings uh, available for pistons do have advantages and the electroless uh, nickel is one, unlike other plating processes that use electrical current quote unquote electroplating. This is electroless plating. It's a chemical process rather than electrical. You don't have to worry about the current carrying better in one part of the part than another portion of the part. And uh, what that helps to do is actually get a very, very, very even coating. You know, sometimes these might be 25 to 100 microns thick. Um, and extremely hard, extremely corrosion resistant. You know, nickel is an element that you'll find in, in different alloys like uh, Inconels and some of the um, higher temperature stainless steels. Um, and it just has really, really good properties at high temperature. By coating the pistons, uh, JE Pistons uh, claims that it'll reduce the overall crown temperature about 20 degrees Celsius. But the real advantage is in this top ring groove here. Typically, when, you, when you're really pushing these engines hard and you're making a lot of boost, creating a lot of heat, micro welding can actually occur here. Um, the softer, the, the aluminum alloy uh, gets soft enough to where it, it almost micro welds to the ring and you lose the, all the integrity basically in the ring land because just the surface isn't hard enough. With a coating like this, um, you, you don't have that problem. So this is great uh, for applications where you may encounter some type of detonation, you may encounter some lean conditions um, temporarily that, that spike these temperatures and it basically keeps the piston working like it should. How does it compare to ceramic coatings? Ceramic barrier coating um, is basically a thermal barrier that's going to be placed on the piston. Its, its main purpose is just to prevent transfer of heat through the crown back into the rest of the piston and it doesn't go into the ring groove. So it's, it's doing nothing to help the, the micro welding uh, challenge that you could have in, in, in a real uh, extremely abusive um, environment. Now, unlike some other coatings, the electroless nickel plating will actually get harder with temperature. So, although it's extremely hard when these pistons are just brand new put in the engine, the heat from the combustion and stuff will actually harden the material even, even more. So, uh, you've got a very, very, very hard surface. Hard surfaces are, are basically something that you're not going to get any wear, any deformation, any type of micro welding here. So, if you have an application that could experience detonation, an electroless nickel coating is definitely an option you probably want to seek on your custom pistons.